It's been a long time since I've seen Nico. And then there's this telegram. Sender unknown. It says Nico's dead. Nico, thank God you're okay. George. I thought something had happened to you. Why would you think that? Um, did I get it wrong completely? This telegram here. I don't know anything about it. You don't know anything about it. Is that all you have to say? As you can see, I'm fine. Would you mind leaving? Nico, what's... I travel all the way from America to be close to you, to look after you. Sorry, George. I'm busy, right? I'd better go then. Would be better. No, it makes no sense to talk to Nico, right? Yes, it's me, Nicole. George has just been in. Huh. No, it may... No, no, it... No, it... I'm kind of expecting a mad clown to jumping around the corner and knocking me out with his accordion now. My fears are proved to be unfounded. Instead, I have questions, so many questions. Does Nico have... I think about it for some time, until I see her sitting there patient. She helped me once. Excuse me. Me? Oh, it's you. Didn't I tell you you would come back? <laughs> um, yes. What have you been doing all this time? I've been selling flowers, telling fortunes to the customer. Well, it's not that. It is to me. Don't you ever get fed up with selling flowers and telling... You know, I've done this for years now. After such a long time, it is difficult to start anything different. You could produce your own TV show. Something like, things you always wanted to know about your future. Not a bad idea, but I think I'm going to... I understand. Good. Oh, no, I'm afraid I don't know what's going on with your girlfriend. Pardon? Ah, uh, you were reading my mind. Well, it's in my nature to predict... And what do I want to ask? You want to know what your girlfriend has been... Damn it, you're absolutely right. Uh, I can't tell you anything precise. Only this. Your girlfriend went out late in the evening. Was she accompanied by a woman? Pardon? A blonde man with a ponytail. Ugly. Where's Speck? I don't think so. Ah, uh, a lot off my mind. After a few days, her going out suddenly stopped. I... What do you mean? She didn't seem to leave. That's not like her at all. Maybe you were talking to... No, I don't think so. I have plenty of time to look at the scenery, if you know. I do. Business. 
Man, you could put- I'm sorry, I didn't want to rub salt into the wound, and I will certainly be back. Can you tell me what's going on with the weather here in Paris? When I arrived, it was- Yes? It's true? And it will rain again today? Well then, I should take advantage of this beautiful weather. Besides, I have nothing but- How about a nice little ice cream? Now that you mention it- In Rouge Park, there is a very- I must be going now. Yeah? Oh no. Excuse me. Oui? Um, yeah. Yes, I can. Could we handle this in the traditional way? Meaning, I ask first and you answer afterwards. That's more familiar to me. Oui? So, can you tell me if I'll go on a long... Do you really want to know that? I guess so. You are going to die. What? If you're not careful... <laughs> Well, that's nothing special. You will meet someone unexpected. That blonde ponytailed worm? No, it's not him. It is a rather good-looking person. Male or female? That's five euros, please. Come on. Well, I'm sorry, but soothing has its price. Pity. But uh, I'll do you a favor. I'll give you this newspaper. Wow, thanks. I'm honored. When the time comes, 